And it should be easy for the Blue Alliance in this next match. 16-78 and 44-14 with their partner, 846, uh, looking to maintain that perfect ranking point uh, qualification match so far that uh, 1678 has at this tournament. Yeah, I'm sure the Red Alliance will have something to say about it. There's tons of firepower over there, but let's take it down to the field to see what happens in match number 22. Match number 22, let's start with the Red Alliance, introducing team 2486. From Flagstaff, Arizona, that's Coco Nuts. Their partners in the middle, it's Team 6036. From Palo Alto, that's Peninsula Robotics. And rounding it out, it's 6800. From Austin, Texas, that's Valor. Over on blue, we've got 846. The Funky Monkeys from San Jose, California. Their partners in the middle, 1678. From Davis, California, that's Citrus Circuits. And running out, we have 4414. From Ventura, California, that's High Tide. We got thumbs up on the field, drivers behind the lines. Three, two, one, go! Here we are in qualification match number 22 at Chessy Champs. Plenty of red cargo and blue cargo in that upper hub. All six robots moving around that field. 6036 delivering some blue cargo into the red climbing zone. Hiding it from the blue alliance as we go into the teleoperated period of this match. Who's gonna shoot the first cargo? Survey says it's high tie with two up for blue. More up for blue and for red though. It is an incredibly close match, 50 to 62. Blue slightly favored, but red has more than enough time to bring it back over. 6036 get in position, 6800 in position, each in for two. 4414 from way downtown making some shots. 6036 just hanging out over here doing some of their own. Citrus Circuits and their robot Margie picking up that blue cargo right at the base of the hub, lining up, dunking them in. It is now 108, that'd make that 114 to 82. Blue widening that gap. Can red turn it around? They're certainly gonna try. 6036 up for one. 6800 up for two more. 2486, that's coconuts. That's one in and good. We've now got about 20 points separating these two alliances. Who can make that gap smaller? Is it gonna be red or blue? Blue's trying to make it bigger. We've got plenty of cargo flying on that upper hub, folks, and still 52 seconds left in this match. Two red robots and their front high tide coming up as they are trying to get all that red cargo into that upper hub, 124 to 162. Point cap grows even larger thanks to Citrus Circuits, High Tide, and the Funky Monkey. That sound means it's time to get on the monkey bars, as Funky Monkeys are doing right now, getting those windmills up, Coconuts doing the same, 44-14, thinking a little bit about what's the plan, they're gonna try and scoot their way back over to their hub. That turret's spinning around. Looks like I may be dragging a module though. We've got one robot up for blue. All oh, it's a traversal. We've got maybe two up for red. 6036 as you stayed on the high rung and two up for blue right at the last second. All right. It looks like we've got the final scores from that match, and going up is the Blue Alliance, 208 to 159. That's gonna go ahead and move 1678 into the number one seed, a place that they know very well. All right, let's, uh, RSN, you got something for us? Yeah, Blue Alliance pulling out that victory, and also joining us here at the desk now, we have Evan Morrison. Um, let's, let's talk about how Blue performed so well there. I mean, it was just massive offense from both alliances, all six robots scoring, um, everybody cracking the 100-point threshold with half the match left to play, and Citrus Circuits and 44-14 high tide 
uh, alongside 846 Funky Monkeys, just balling out. Um, 846 getting a last minute clutch climb for a few extra points, but I mean, what can you say? These are some of the best offensive robots we have here. These teams showed it all season and they continue here in the off season, even with new players, with a uh, new school year coming in, uh, really high level of competition here at Chessie Champs in 2022. And Citrus Circuit's maintaining their five point RP average, uh, clutching into that number one spot. They're one of two teams left that have perfect records so far here at Chessie. Um, but the competition is fierce. You can see 159 points by the Red Alliance. For sure. I mean, just to get an idea of some of the cargo numbers these teams are putting up, Blue Alliance had 12 uh, cargo in auto. They hit their 40 cargo mark with a minute 26 to go in the match. Red Alliance, not to be outdone, still hit their 40 cargo with a minute four. But, you know, Blue Alliance outscored them by 12 cargo total, just in, in terms of getting those cargo through the goal. Let's take